This is part two of the 3.07 records per million. All right, so we're going to go ahead and do this problem. Calculate the molarity of a dye concentration, given the molar mass of the dye is 327 grams per mole, and a dye concentration of two parts per million. That means if I had a million milliliters, or a million gallons, or a million oceans full, okay, how many of those million parts would be the dye? Two. Two out of a million. All right, so where do we start with this one? Start with what you know. And if parts per milligram, or sorry, parts per million is one milligram of solute per liter of solution, and we have two parts per million, we would then have two milligrams per liter. And we need to change our two milligrams per liter into grams per liter. So, as a reminder, you can use the metric staircase and pretend you're a little person on the staircase. Where do we start? We start with milligram and we're going to grams. So, one, two, three hops, three hops to the left. So, we take our decimal, which was right here, and we have to move it one, two, three hops to the left. So, when we do that, we end up getting 0.002 grams per liter. All right, so now we need to convert it. What are we converting to? We're trying to find molarity. What's the unit for molarity? Unit for molarity is moles per liter. Now I want to show you something else that I did. We had up here 0 0.002 grams per liter. Remember, Per means divided by, so let's just move that liter down here where it belongs in the fraction. So same thing. I just moved the liters down here where it belongs, and now we're going to convert into moles per liter. So we already have the liters part. What do we need to convert the grams into? We need to convert them into moles. So what unit has to go on the bottom of my second fraction? It has to be grams, so they cancel. And again, I'm changing my grams two moles, so what number goes on the bottom? Read the story problem again if you need to. 327 grams for every one mole, and then we put it in our calculator, 0 0.002 times one divided by one divided by 327, and we get 0 0.000061 moles per liter, or 6.1 times 10 to the negative six molar. Either way. All right, again, we get this from scientific notation by how many places we move the decimal. So one, two, three, four, five, six. We stop here because we have one number that's not a zero in front of the decimal. So it's 6.1. We moved it six hops, so it's to the sixth, and our starting number was less than one, so therefore it is to the negative sixth. All right, as always, if you have questions, let me know. Otherwise, do the pre-quiz, check your answers, and then go ahead and take the quiz.